Okay, so this is how to um, access Dropbox via, via the web interface. Go to the Dropbox website. On the top right, click Login. And we log in. And um, you'll see all the folders. So you can just go to any of the folders and download the file. Um, like this. Now, don't uh, on Internet Explorer, you're going to see the Run option. Don't choose Run. When you choose Run, it downloads the temporary folder and messes everything up. The same thing for your email attachments. Always it's safe. Okay, so that you can edit and you know and find it later. Er, people lose their files all the time. So save it, and there is a file, and that's that's probably your PowerPoint or whatever. That that's what it gets used most often for. Um, let's see, and you can upload files. Um, you can upload files. Uh, let's see, uh, you know, like this. Um, and you get uploaded to the current folder that's open. Right now we're in under Education Computer Class and 2007. So that's where it will get added. Uh, we already added that. Start upload. And there. The file is there. And eventually, uh, my computer is hard to show it um, because um, right now it's still syncing. Um, but um, it will. After it's done syncing, it will show up uh, here. Let's see. You can. <coughs> um, another way of downloading your files is if you just download your power. If you just finish your PowerPoint for a presentation and saved it, it's kind of a hassle to find it on the folder or navigate the folder structure. You can just go to the Events tab, and whatever file you have just saved will be shown here. So you can download it uh, directly from here. Uh, just click on whatever file you are looking for, like um, like this file, and it will download. Um, let's see. You can use this also to recover files you deleted by accident. You delete a file, the change was spread throughout the, the, all the computers, and you lost it. But if you go to Events tab, um, it will show you which files you deleted, and you can all you have to do is click it, and then you can download that latest version that was there when you deleted it. Um, mm, yeah, uh, uh, that's how you use the web interface. Oh, and um, <coughs> uh, the KRC laptop, right now we have KRC, the KRC laptop set up with um, Dropbox set up. Not to download all the files because, I mean, you don't need to do all the work there, but it's syncing just this folder, the inbox folder. Um, so uh, all you have to do is, whenever you have a presentation, just drop the PowerPoint here, and then in a few, and turn on the, the laptop. In a few seconds, it will download the file. You don't need to use any USB, and then put it on standby and go off to your presentation. 